Well, again, I said that we were going to be doing some Facebook exclusive content, and I'm trying to deliver on those promises. And if you're going to do a men's basketball season media day, Facebook Live, who better to talk to than probably the guy who's going to be one of the big leaders on the team this year, Devontae Kaycock, the senior post player, uh, who was just announced today as a first team All CAA member. So, congratulations on that, man. I, I know the individual honors maybe don't mean as much to you, you want the team stuff, but with all that you have accomplished over the last couple of years, does anything kind of hold a, a special place to you uh, in terms of everything you've done? Um, just nothing really specifically. Uh, like, I, like you said earlier, I'm like to have this team. I'm more team oriented than individual stuff like that. But um, it's, 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 it's cool to have some of the, some of the records I have and stuff like that. But like you said, I don't really it doesn't seem like that long ago you were a, uh, a freshman coming in here trying to figure out your way. Now you're suddenly the senior, the veteran, the leader on this team. How have you handled that role now that that's what you're going to be playing this year? Uh, well, I kind of I feel like I definitely matured from last year. Uh, going into my junior year, I had a lot of weight on my shoulders. Um, I was basically already the leader my junior year with Jordan Taylor. And just now I'm embracing it even more. Uh, going into my senior year now, I'm just really set into being a leader and just trying to do as best as I can, trying to show the young guys how things are done, trying to talk to them, coach them up, and uh, doing whatever it may be I need to do to help my team out like I always try to do. And just doing as much as I can. Uh, it's going to be cool being the same. Uh, four years, it, it went by fast, like you said. I can't believe I'm going to be It's fun to be here. We saw you step out a little bit from the basket last year. Same kind of thing this year. Have you even found more diversity to that game? Yeah, definitely. I've been trying to uh, continue to be more comfortable outside of my range and stuff like that. I'm doing more on the court, uh, opening up my game, which opening up for my teammates as well. And uh, that's definitely what I plan on showcasing this year. Uh, senior year, got to do what I have to do. So not even just that, but also defensively. I can guard more than just one or two positions. That's the plan this year. What's it been like with this team this year? It seems so much deeper than it was last year, both in the post and at the guard spot. What's it like having so many guys out there competing right now? Yeah, it's, it's definitely a lot, a lot more deeper. We got 14 guys in the play, <laughs> and uh, that definitely makes things more competitive. That makes things more intense. It basically makes people have to learn the minutes, which is how things usually happen and what I used to experience. And how you practice them. How you practice is how you don't play. And that's what the coach is basically thing I'm on. So we watch lots of films, uh, break things down for each other, one of us on what we got to work on and what we're not doing properly, especially me. I mess up all the time. And I like, I talk to Jack and he gives me all the time what I got to do. Uh, it's just the experience. We're, we're all learning. And um, we'll get there. There's some banners up here from championship appearances, CA titles and stuff. I'm sure you'd like to add another one up there for your senior year. What are your expectations for you last year? Uh, definitely to go back to the NCAA tournament. But uh, you've got to realize it's not just going to happen overnight. It's the whole season. You know, you've got to take it game by game, uh, get ready for the CAA after that, and get ready for the CAA tournament once you get to the NCAA tournament. And like I said, we got to take game by game, just be patient with it. And, um, as long as we do what we have to do on the court and just do what we got to do everywhere else, we should be fine. All right. That's it. Thanks so much for joining in and appreciate Devontae stopping by. Thank you. Thank you.